This is what you and the rest Corvette lovers all around the world did not expect for the 2024 C8 Corvette. And this is especially so because the introduction of the two hit cars, the high-performance Z06, and the 70th anniversary model last year got fans induced with enough dopamine subconsciously to get extremely excited for the 2024 model year. But is this excitement slightly misplaced? In this video, we're going to discuss all about the 2024 C8 Corvette and why enthusiasts might just be getting this bit disappointed. Let's dive in. Chevrolet pretty much outdid itself with the introduction of the Z06 for the 2023 model year and with massive success with the automotive press and the buying public, Chevy's bet has indeed paid off. But finally, it is time to hand over the place at the helm for the next successor, the 2024 C8 Corvette, which means the end of production for the 2023 model. And according to the information on ground, this will fully establish, starting September 1st, and the subsequent retail production of its 2024 counterpart will see its beginning from September 5th, which is the day Labor Day proceeds. Chevy went on to reveal that the vehicle vehicle order guide will be out on July 10th and the visualizer to go live 8 days later on the 18th. As for the official ordering dates, nothing is revealed yet. But enough with this boring stats, right? What well wants to know is how good this car will be. And that's where we come to the sole point of this video. What everyone has been waiting for. The secret that Chevy kept hidden, but not pretty well. Just like that like button below this video. It all smashes over, but of course with your help. So smash that icon and let's get real. Here's the thing. The 2024 C8 Corvette isn't anything new. It's all just a carryover model. I know, I know enthusiasts won't be happy, but consider it this way. With the 2023 model, somehow everyone seemed to be happy. I mean, exclusively including the dozen production constraints and shutdowns. It all just worked out because fans seemed to get the power they needed in the Z06, and there was the Z07 package for more aesthetics and luxury. Plus, enthusiasts seemed pretty happy too. So if you are disappointed, you have to remind yourself that what you actually loved last year is coming again, but newer. And of course, there's the rumor of the 2024 model year being the year Chevy introduces the plug-in hybrid Corvette E-Ray, though Chevy hasn't said anything official yet. But here's the thing. The 2024 model year is going to be all about the Stingray, Z06, and E-Ray already introduced, receiving minor changes and updates, with no real noticeable difference, plus the potential introduction of the C8 Corvette ZR1 model. So if you're gonna get this cars and wait in line in the order list later this year, then you might just want to know all about what you're signing up for. And that's why we're going to discuss five features this car will be carrying over into the new model year, if there are slightly any upgrades starting with the exterior. Since it's all just a carryover model, the 2024 C8 shouldn't see the redesign of the exterior styling. This means that just like on the 2023 model, this car will feature an aggressive design with angular front end, wide air intakes, sharp headlights, and prominent body lines on the hood. Over on the side, we have the Corvette featuring enormous vents just shy of the door to cool the engine and wide fenders. The rear is dominated by square exhaust outlets and elongated taillights. But with the Z06, you get even angrier designs with a large front splitter, even larger wheels a real hefty rear spoiler, and quad exhaust outlets that make their way out from the rear bumper. All these features will continue to remain on the 2024 Model C8 with no noticeable changes. The interior. This has a futuristic look. The two seats making up the interior comfort are separated by a long divider that extends out of the dashboard and houses most of the car's controls. The touchscreen gets a position heavily angled toward the driver, while the transmission's push buttons are placed under the display. The Corvette, however, being a two-seater, does not have the largest cabin, but makes up for it with the presence of high-end materials, especially with a 3LT trim. And like previous Corvettes, the coupe has removable roof panels and everything is expected to go unchanged, remaining exactly as is. Before we move on, take a second to appreciate this video by leaving a like if you're getting value so far, and subscribing to our channel to help us reach our goal of 1,000 subscribers before June 1st, and if you want to keep getting more Corvette news like this one. Next up, we have the tech features. The Corvette is pretty much well-equipped also for a sports car. The base trim comes standard with an 8-inch touchscreen, Android Auto, wireless Apple CarPlay, Bluetooth, two USB ports, Wi-Fi hotspot, 10 audio speakers, satellite radio, and an HD radio, plus the additional features of navigation, a dash cam, a wireless charging pad, and a 14 audio speakers. These tech features will continue to be offered on the 2024 C8 Corvette. Moving on, we have the power options. The introduction of the Z06 has now made it possible to have three levels of power offered on the Corvette. The standard engine present is a 6.2-liter V8 engine that gives out 490 horsepower. However, with the performance exhaust system, the power makes a skip to 495 horsepower. The Z06 comes together with a 5.5-liter V8 engine that generates a beastly 670 horsepower. All Corvettes coming with a rear-wheel drive as well as an 8-speed dual-clutch automatic transmission. As there won't be any changes for the 2024 model, year, Corvette fans can at the very least be comforted that the C8 retains its exclusive power-giving ability, which is a win too. What are your thoughts? Leave a comment. 
Now finally for the last of the five, we have the safety features. Again, the new Corvette will retain all existing features in this sector provided by Chevrolet. This means that the Corvette will basically carry over the not so much offering of advanced safety features as standard. Things featured should include a rear view camera, rear parking sensors, and a teen driver system. The safety features will include a rear camera mirror, a head up display, rear cross traffic, a forward facing camera, and blind spot monitoring. The only thing that will in fact be different for 2024 is the addition of forward collision alert, front pedestrian braking, following distance indicator, lane keep assist with lane departure warning, and the Intelli beam, which is your automatic high beams. There have also been the removal and subsequent replacement of some exterior and interior colors now available. These include the addition of Riptide Blue Metallic Hackty and Seawolf Gray Tricoat for the exterior of the array, and the addition of the Artemis Dip colorway for the interior. Now these are features that have not been included in the past for the C8 Corvette. These are all new for the 2024 model year. About the pricing and release dates, we expect the 2024 C8 Corvette to arrive at dealerships in the fall of 20. 2023. And of course, since there has actually been no noticeable change, we expect the Corvette to hover at a price point close to what we have on the current model, with a range of $65,895 to $77,845 with the addition of destination charges. But with the high-performing Z06, the range is had from a price point of $109,295 to a hopping $123,145. However, breaking down the price of the current Model C here, without the subsequent breakdown of all the detailed features that makes it rise up to that price point could seem just a little bit off, maybe confusing. That's why in this video over here, we discuss all the features present on the 2023 C8 Z06, as well as a full breakdown on why it costs so much, so you can know what to expect. I recommend you watch that next.